With the midterm elections just around the corner, the Democratic candidates for Congress, freeholder and sheriff seats came to the city of Patterson to receive the endorsement from the Peruvian American Political Action Committee. Right now, the, our city is in difficult times too because the budgets got reduced. That's why Peruvian American, we got this in, in this moment and we support all the raw big. I love the Peruvian Americans, not just before election time. This has been my soul for many, many years. I remember meeting with the first Peruvians. Mr. Caligari was one of the first immigrants from Peru to come to this country. And nothing has changed. They're beautiful people. They believe in family. They believe in education. And that's why they're so successful. I'm proud to be here tonight. Republicans and Democrats are in a tough race to win the Hispanic vote for the upcoming midterm elections in the county of Passaic. One of the toughest races is the one for the sheriff's seat. And with your help, ladies and gentlemen, and God's help, I will be the next sheriff of Passaic County. Yeah. Viva Peru, God bless everyone. And I am the more qualified candidate. I've got uh, a lot of training, I've got a lot of experience, I've been out on the road. My opponent has not made one single arrest. I've been out there, I've been involved in drug arrests, gun arrests, I've housed prisoners, I've transported prisoners, I've arrested people on warrants. I have the experience necessary for this job and will be the next Passaic County Sheriff. After enjoying Peruvian typical dishes, freeholder candidates show their optimism and concerns about the tough economy that the state is facing. The main issue in the county of Passaic and, and everywhere are taxes. Uh, that's the first word on everybody's lips. And that's why um, we have done our part in consolidating departments, reducing spending, and that resulted in an upgrade by the financial rating system, Moody's. You know, we've been upgraded twice in two years. And they have indicated that Passaic County is better situated to... to um, uh, get through this economic downturn better than any county in the state and or the nation. Well, we're not immune for, to all the cuts that he's done, and it's very difficult. You know, it's easy to, to uh, have those mandates come down from Trenton, but we have to deal with them day to day. How do you cut some of the programs that we have? So we need to, to have a, it's a double-edged sword out there. So we need to work harder with Trenton to show them the needs that we have, legitimate needs, and not forget where we came from. Sometimes this governor might forget where he comes from. The diversity of political committees within the county will play a key role in these elections, as their support is as diverse as their roots. Sheriff candidates will be face-to-face -face on Friday in a public forum that will take place at Passaic County Community College. Fabiola Galindo, LaMiraTV.com.